Hello guys, and uh, this is Dasmato. I will be playing Rome 2, and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna pick what faction. I decided I'm gonna try Sparta because, well, Sparta is awesome, and Rome is pretty much what everybody's doing, and I'm most likely gonna do it on my own time. Alright, start. So yeah, been looking forward to this game for years pretty much. I played the the prequel about ten years ago. Loved it. Pretty much. I actually still played it. Play every once in a while, the old one, Rome One. It was so good. I love the variety and just everything. I'm hoping this will disappoint. <laughs> The loading screens are pretty much the same as in Rome 1 though, super long. Hmm. I'm probably gonna edit this out. <coughs> <coughs> this should be interesting. The people of Epirus are fools. Having utterly failed to conquer Rome, they crawl back and presume to conquer Greece. To try is not to win. They will know this when you meet them in battle. Macedon may join you, but they are no better in the end. Alexander's conquests have left them with delusions of grandeur. They will be checked, as will every other aggressor. You may fare better working with Athens and other true Greek states, but history has often taught otherwise. Ultimately, trust only in Sparta, and you will prevail. Graphics are pretty nice in this game, but I don't know. I had to lower a lot of settings. It's not very well optimized yet. Spies are subterfuge experts, recruited via yeah, the higher well agents aware. button when a settlement is selected. They can right. be recruited anywhere in your empire, and are invisible to the enemy until detected. This tab enables you to research the- Thank you very much. Uh, how do I turn you guys off? Let's see. Let's go for that first. Diplomacy. Let's see this. This is interesting. Greetings, friend. Greetings. Will you have wine, fine olives, or agreeable talk? I dare not ask much for my people. Sure. Let's see if they actually do anything. Alrighty. You can call me Nukes. But swift and silent, a shadow among the shadows. Some of these graphics are dreadful. What the hell happened? It's like looking at Rome 1 again. Hmm. 
müssen. Yeah, certainly didn't do much. Ready for battle. At your command. All right, let's hire some units. Upkeep, ninety. Ready for battle. Commander. All right. How does this work? Where's my money? Oh, down there. Wait. Hmm. Alright. We'll attack Larissa next turn. We offer this as a sign of accord reached and new accord. Oh, screw you guys. I'm surprised, they actually did diplomacy this time. In uh in Rome Total War One it was basically only you sometimes forced trying to make them surrender. So a really long AI load time. <sighs> Finally. Alright. Jesus Christ, this game is not run the best. Let them cower like cannel dogs. You can call me. Commander, we hunger for battle at your command. Hmm. All right, I guess we'd for the next turn. Once again, the five hour long wait. So I'm basically gonna try and build up my farms and uh, economy.
and not try and attack much. Well, not try and over expand. Because, uh, well, it ends up collapsing after a while. And the game basically just stops as you can't afford anything and rebellions spring up. At least the AI is a bit faster. At least the computer seems to be running the AI is coding faster this time. Let's see. Alright. That's useful. Oh my god. Sparta. <laughs> All right, let's try and upgrade our economy a bit more. I'd like to go for economy first, just simply because I think it it's more worthwhile. Oh, what's that? Oh, the spend. Hmm. I could fool Hades himself. The gods would not allow. Commander! I am unstoppable. Level up. Hmm. I'm not sure what, uh, where to go with this yet, because I don't really understand this yet. So. I guess I'll just go overall success. At your command. Make haste, men. Waiting for more orders. Hire any more mercenaries? Cavalry, it's always good. Hmm. Alright, I'm still making a sufficient sum. At your service. Sparta is still in the process of building. Okay. Alright. Let's see if Erebus decides to try and actually defend their land. <laughs> 